Alrighty, Silver. Watcher coming at you for another quick video. So, I had had a viewer ask me a long time ago to do a video on my shot. And I said yes, and then completely forgot about it. So, I forgot who the viewer was, and I apologize. But here we go. So, What's going on? Why was I buying it? Why did I stop? And what happened? Okay. So, what do we got here? You got a four nines and a triple nines. All right, so starting it off. I purchased a 10 ounce and a five ounce triple nines through Atmex. And I went to go purchase another five it turns out they had switched to four nines. So I started stacking five at a time. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty. You know my videos, five ounces a week, five ounces a week, so it was boring to just sing shot for a while, but 5, 10, 15, 20. I was getting it, if it was $100 for 5 ounces, I was getting the shot for about 89 or 90 bucks. So why'd I stop? If it was cheaper and I was getting such a good deal? Well, I did a whole video. I didn't even label this because I was just so disgusted with that mix. These were always overweight. I've, I did many, many videos. Apparently, that mix was watching because... I soon ordered this, 5 ounce, and it came out to 4.67. I mean, not even close to 5 ounces. So I stopped buying it. And yeah, it was a good deal. Sorry, I had to go grab the stuff to show you what I was talking about, so. I know, give me a second. It's getting boring, I know. Here it comes. So yeah. Once a week I was unboxing one of these. And one time I did, and it had 4.67 or whatever. It was very disheartening. I made the whole video about it. I gave up buying Silver Shot because guess what? I'm not in the habit of wanting to get ripped off. Go figure. So everyone was like, contact at Max. H how? You think they're going to believe me? There's no stamps, there's no weight. And once you take the packaging off and unseal it, you ever think they're going to believe you for a second that they underweighted it? Nope. I've dealt with that mix in the past. They act like it's your fault that you didn't recognize that they screwed up. Yeah, read into what I just said. But, so for a while I was winning. I posted many videos about it. I think ultimately Atmex was watching and that's why they started screwing me. You know, I have no other option to believe why. Because if this is coming from a distributor, type of scenario and for all those who say he doesn't know what he's talking about if you go back and watch the videos I purposely bought this scale just to check to make sure the weights were correct and before you go all crazy yeah I had it on troy ounces and I do know how to tear so Sorry, the video is extremely late. 
Sorry, I kind of just stopped making those videos and I didn't say anything. But it's really frustrating. As many people say, because there's no way... I mean, zoom in. You can see there. Where's the markings? Where's the markings? There's no triple fine, there's no quadruple fine, there's not one fine, not two fine, no triple fine, just nothing. So, when you're dealing with shot, you have no... discernible way of telling how much it weighs. And they short you, and you weigh it. I guess that's on you. So, for everyone who thought it was a good idea. It is, if you're winning, like I said, if they find out you're winning, well guess what? You can say, I just got a one-off, and out of all this, I only see, you know, but no. Can you imagine the shitstorm if I was selling, and I sold this many, and then one time I sold 4.67? My reputation would be gone. No one would buy silver ever again from me. Why? Because he has a reputation of ripping people off. I mean, I did want to get to 100 ounces, and I did want to pour my first 100 ounce bar by myself. But as it stands, was it 2020? No. Okay, so... 20, 40, this is 15, and this is 4.67, but according to Atmex, since it's 5, okay, 5, or, uh, 20, 40, 60 ounces a shot, technically. So, the other thing I've been debating on, guys, you can comment in the comment section, since this is only 5 ounces, whatever, and this is 15 ounces, a triple 9, and this is quadruple, 4 9s, should I just met? Focus. Should I just add and mix them together? Will it matter? Any my, anyone who pours on my, that watches my channel, please let me know, because I'm tempted really, really much just to combine this over here, so I can just make a new label, and have 202020. 20, 20, right? It's my OCD and me. But you can see I'm holding strong. This is, I haven't made the sign for this either. Five ounces, <laughs> right, of four nines. And then we got 15 of three nines. I'm just saying, would anyone even notice? Would anyone even really care? One, if I put that in there. And two, when I did melt it, I'm not a mathematician, but what is, you're adding more pure into a non-pure stuff. So, would I get a 20 ounce, I mean, do you see where the retarded levels I'm going? If this is a 20 ounce, has anyone ever, what does that do to the premium? If it was 20 ounce quadruple fine, well this one, it, wouldn't it be a higher premium? If it was only 3 nines fine? But I know that's the old debate, everyone goes no. So, I've had them separate. So, once again, in my last one, I'll say the same thing. I know it may look like I don't have a lot, and I know it may look like I have a lot. If you don't have any, I have a lot. If you have more than me, then what is he doing? I, I, I don't have anything compared to, you know, right? But anyway, you're having a good one. You're still watching. Silver Watcher away!